Hello everybody, welcome back to Sarah Place Gorok in Immortal Empires. And I left off with this battle with Oxyadol, so it says I lose my Stegadon if I fight this. Or if I auto-resolve this. So... Oh, no, it's a settlement battle. Alright, I'm sorry. I, I really don't want to fight a settlement battle. Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, and I can't camp. That sucks. This, this doofus is gonna come after me, probably. Well. It is what it is. I... I don't know. I was hoping I would be able to, uh... Camp, but I cannot. So. Can I, okay, I was gonna say, can I not get by? Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Replenishment up here is going to be the worst. But that's okay. I don't need growth as much. Don't care about control. Income. I have better things I can do. I just finished a Bretonia recording, and it's so weird going from Bretonia to Lizardmen. The Lizardmen who I like feel super comfortable with playing, and then Bretonia who I just don't. Are you gonna swim into a little hole here? Pyrrhic victory. Alright. Hold, please. Because if I have both of them, I think I shouldn't. It shouldn't be a pyrrhic victory. Decisive victory. Yes, that's what we like to see. Took more casualties than I should have if I had just fought it. All right, Krotgar, where was I taking you? I think I need to take you up to, to take out Lokir up here. It's been a while since I played, so I don't really remember all that I was doing. Really don't love this. Really don't love this, Kolek. I don't know what you're up to. I don't know where you're going. But I don't like it. Oh, and there's the Sun Eater himself. Level 48 Kolek. That's scary sauce. Alright, I'm gonna have you camp. Ha! <laughs> My Stegadon stack. And Nakai. <laughs> Who's gonna get hit by Archaeon? Because <laughs> I think I moved him first thing. Um, you need to replenish. Tic-tac-toe. Okay, so I had done half a turn before I got hit with that battle with Axiatl and thought, oh, hey, I'll fight this. Didn't look at the map to see that it's not a battle that I want to fight, so that made up my mind for me. Alright, so anything fun here? No. Okay. Oh wait, get that out of here. Hmm. 
had a lot of people lately say, I can't believe you're still doing this campaign. Honestly, I'm a little surprised myself. It does take a lot. But it helps when you're playing a faction you really like playing, so. I haven't gotten bored at all. Same with Meow. I liked playing Meow's campaign a lot. And I feel like there's still battles that I have had to fight, so... It's not like I'm auto-resolving everything. Just most things. It's funny, Jason's been playing lately, and he gets like, I don't know, 75 turns in, and he's done. He's like, if I get to a certain point where I'm not accomplishing, like, I already know I've won, I just stop. And I'm like, I mean, in this case, like, I know I can win this, but I still want to keep going. And I'm, again, just curious to see what's going to happen when all the enemies are gone. Like, maybe if you're friends with everybody, you just... Everybody lives in harmony together. I I don't know. Oh, I used all my money. I can't repair the buildings. Okay. Let's see if our Kaon goes after Nakai. I mean, he most certainly will have to, right? Hey, quit assaulting my garrison. Stinking Nurgle. It's a demon prince. Are you scared, Lokir? Are you scared? You can't offer me 200. Although, to be fair, that's probably the only money he has left. He's been put out of business. Our Kaon. Did we pass you? We must have passed you, right? I think so. See, AI Lewin is doing well. AI Lewin's in the top 45. Sarah Lewin? I don't know. Alright, what are we looking at here? Oh, you're pretty banged up. So I'll just camp this guy and move him up. Kaquata's got a beefy garrison too. So I'll wait till my Ripper Dactyls are in a good spot. I don't. Oh, there are some black arcs down there, but I'll just head north for now. Actually, I could probably head one north and one south. I'm coming, Loki here. Alright, Ruwar. See, with your army being right here, I'm just gonna... Oops, I forgot there actually was another army here. Alright, so Ruwar can come up this way. If I've already got an army down there. I just can't believe Kolek has not declared war on me yet. I am shocked. Oh, Nakai can't camp? That's such a stupid thing. Yeah, I'm gonna need somebody else over here to stop our Kaon. Maybe I'll have to bring Tic-Tac-Toe over. 
Because he'll probably take Stormbrack Mount. Oh, Oxyadol. At least you replenish fast. Hex talk. I think next turn, Krokar can take out that one place of Lokiers. Oh, my income. My income hurts. I'll put income building just for fun. <sighs> you go kill this guy. See if you can kill Kolek, the the dark elf cousin of Kolek. Sweet, good job. Some income building so that I know twenty seven thousand it's not good enough for me. Oops, well I guess that's the end of that turn. I do have to apologize. I haven't been streaming lately because I've been playing Baldur's Gate. Are you serious? They're probably right. This probably is a I don't know, I feel like I should fight it just to, just to see. But yeah, I've been playing a lot of Baldur's Gate 3. You guys talked me into it. People I work with talked me into it. So I ended up buying the game and I've been playing like nonstop. Outside of like this stuff, which I, I like playing Warhammer. But I just have not been streaming. Streaming is fun, don't get me wrong. I really like to stream. But it's also kind of exhausting because I have a very short attention span. And I... I can't get on in stream for like three, four hours very easily. So it's kind of straining. All right, I'm going to just try to rush. That's my goal. Ah, she's all the way over there. We got two minutes. Oh, she's on a dragon. Dragon? So it might be kind of hard to fight at level 35. Especially if she's flying. Because she can use her dragon breath on me. Run! Ooh. I do have barrier. Oh, ouchie. Okay, well, this is not going well. Well, I didn't take into account that she was level 35 when I decided to fight this. I thought, oh, I can take on four units. Totally forgetting that she had a dragon. So... Don't flee, warriors. Come back. Everything's fine. You can do this. Alright, they're almost dead. Oh, goody. Another dragon. Or a man manticore. What, is she on a horse? Ouch! A poor skinks. Don't worry, guys. You can do this. No problem. Just blob up and hope for the best. I 
I'm gonna end up doing more casualties. I'll just melee mode them. She did take some damage though. Don't underestimate the skinks. Oh, they're routing. You can do it, Saurus. You can do it, Saurus. Okay. Game's like, we're not playing this anymore. <laughs> wow. My Saurus didn't kill anybody? She did 248 dam damage. Yeah, 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 that's... Makes sense. Again, I just looked at it and I was like, oh, just a lord and a reaper bolt thrower. Yeah, but a thirty level 35 caster lord, you dummy. I should have known from the name. Colin Dreadtongue is like a pretty uh, common lord that I've seen since like the beginning. Oh, shocker. All right. All right. I don't know what the honorable is for Lewin. I should have checked. I should know because I'm playing him. Well, that was dumb. Good job, buddy. Settlement besieged. All right, so what do we got going on here? We've got Ruwar. Can head over that direction. Don't want to touch the other ones. Except this guy is moving back up that way, so. Gorok, I wonder if It's funny, like, because I'm not at war with Kolek, he's not going to help with this garrison, but he's he's friends with Zatan, so it's just weird how it works out. Like it makes sense, it's just weird. Can you kill Mortis? The Death Hag? Stomp on her with your dragon feet. Nope. Okay. Nice try. Alright, so that's a colic thing. I kind of want to take care of Zatan before I go after Kolek. Oh, Nakai! Nakai! I'm not fighting this, because look at that. That's gross. I'm just gonna appear a victory and call it a day. And then spend the next two years replenishing. And he's got two more up here. What? Dweebs. He... He's coming for me, isn't he? That's Daniel, isn't it? Alright, so... I don't know. I'm gonna have Tic-Tac-Toe go to crack a drack. I keep changing my mind what I'm gonna do with him. 
I bet now Oxyaddle can take this no problem. That's what I thought. <laughs> Do not stop me. And I can camp. It's a beautiful thing. Can't quite get to the Grayling moot though, but I can try to come down to the monolith of your cold bloody hand. I think this is a dead end. Oh no, I can't get through there. Well, oh well. Luan, are you going to help against Bellicor? Holy crap. We got Luan armies everywhere. Alright, that's what I thought. Hello, cat. Well, I will siege. Luan, come assist. Come assist me. Alright, so we got these guys down here. Can't quite get to them. Like I said, they're gonna just outpace me. But... Rockgar is going to take high chai. I don't know if this means that he can't spawn any more black arcs. Maybe it doesn't mean anything at all. Does he have... He has one more settlement. Where is this? Oh, that's right, because he took that... Well, that's, that's the stupidest thing. this hero action success chance well that one hero is going to need that so all right Krokgar leveled up and Nakai leveled up I do recall that and again we're just going full on into the Kroxigors which I can't get to because I need to put another point in here, which stinks. What's this? Oh, is that growth? The walls. Probably should have put growth here, but kind of over it. Oops, I think I got more to spend. Hockland. Lorlorn's where I can't put anything yet. Serpent Ashwari. Oh, sweet. I can get rid of that growth and that growth. Lovely, lovely. I feel like at this point, if you live in this world and you see how much these lizardmen have taken over and how powerful they are, like, yes, for one, that's why all of the factions should want to be friends with you. But two, like, I would be really worried if they weren't accepting my diplomacy because I feel like it would show they have ulterior motives. Because I certainly haven't been shy about declining their offers, so. Maybe they'll all band together. Maybe they're having secret diplomacy against me, and as soon as all of our common enemies are gone, they're gonna all declare war on me and wipe me out. Look at you, Franz. You've worked your way up to rank 25. Because I helped you. Because I gave you that building. 
for that settlement and you actually I think I gave you two settlements you've just bounced right back buddy oh yeah I should have known Lewin assist me or just take him out I don't care you can do it I'm not going to complain if you just take him out Pyrrhic victory, medium casualties, it's fine. I've been really loosey-goosey about that. Okay. Domination campaign victory. Let's just see where we're at. Yeah, yeah. We're still going. I'm still going. I can do this. Like I said, I want to at least get to the point that I was with Meow, where my current enemies are gone. And... Admiral Lokir, but not Lokir Felhart? Short sighted. What? Like, I'm sure it's entirely possible to have two people with the same name, but still, Lokir's kind of a big deal. You couldn't run from me, Chichimon. So now it's mostly Kolek. You shouldn't have left, Colin. You will never hold us. Because now. You don't have a home region, and you've got just yourself fail. and a hero. No. You are doomed. You cannot win. You may as well go confederate with Malekith. I'm surprised that Malekith- well, actually, maybe they haven't met Malekith yet. How are we looking down here? So we've got Kolek, 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 Zatan. I was hoping to wipe out Zatan before I go to war with Kolek, but I feel like that's not going to happen because Zatan's got some deep territories up through here, and I'm going to have to. Who the heck? Dolgan. Oh, it's their vassal. Um. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end up going to war with Kolek. We'll wait till Lokir's gone. And then all these armies can... Yeah, all these armies can start to converge. All right, so has everybody moved? Hex talk. I think Krokgar would still replenish if I went out, but I'm not going to chance it. Ruwar, Gorok. Yeah, you're going to stay there because you might end up fighting Lothar. Mortis! Kill Mortis! Alright, nice try. Alright, 
Let's see if we can get Nanli. Nanli. We might need both armies to take Nanli. Okay, one more turn for my Stegastack. And... We got us a Daniel. Yeah, he's gonna run away. And I can't go that far, I don't think. Oh, can I? Oh, yeah! And we got the plague. From Nurgle. Lovely. Love it. Alright, Tehenowin. Let's get you in this icy murk. Seattle. I'm just gonna take Sorrel. Char make a skull taker shall fall. May as well do some maintenance while I'm in here. I think Oxyadal was one of the last ones to move anyway. Yeah, because I think I started with those guys, so. Okay. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I'm just gonna... See, I want to make sure they all have garrisons before I, like, set them to auto-populate. Because, for whatever reason, the AI does not like to put in walls. And I'm out of money. And I forgot this building's damaged. Oh, I can I can fix it. Now I'm so broke. And I clicked the button, but that's okay, because I was at the end of my turn anyway. So we'll let this loop around, and that's probably gonna be the end of this one. <laughs> Tyrion, why is why is Malekith still a thing? I've been holding up my end. I took out Snitch. I'm basically gonna take out Loki. Loki, you've got like one army. You don't need to think about this. Oh no. I almost want to fight that just to spite you. Do I seriously have to take out all the black arcs before he's gone? That's gonna be super annoying. That's probably what I have to do because you can recruit. Can you? Oh no! Did Lewin leave me? He was right there! This AI, I tell ya. He's probably salty because I haven't accepted any um, alliances with him. Alright, well, Lokir's still out there because he's got, what, three black arcs? Four black arcs? Hanging around, so we're so close to wiping out Lokir, which has been 200 turns in the, the making, but that's going to be it for this one, everybody. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that I will see you guys in the next one.